Hello guys, this is Analo Alex Gaming. We're now playing Man of Madden. We're now ready to dive on the plane that were crash YOLO and we're now in a Duke of Milan ship and we're gonna start the mission in deep water so if you like this man of metal content just be sure to leave a like and subscribe and don't forget to hit also the notification bell so you're always updated to all of my videos let's go let's play man of metal enjoy You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Fliss, we paid a lot of money for this particular dive, in this particular spot. Every time I take a group of you people out, it's the same thing. No regard for anyone else's customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? How experienced are you? <laughs> Excuse me? I mean, I know what your fake credentials say, but I don't know the truth. <laughs> Were you snooping around? You don't trust me? The fake certificate is only temporary. My old one expired and renewal out here is like extortion, okay? This dive is supposed to bankroll the fees. But that's not exactly following the rules now, is it? So I guess that applies to all of us. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Come on, you see anyone else out here? Who's gonna know? We logged our route at the harbor. If someone sees it's been disturbed, it ain't gonna be hard to put two and two together. Especially if some little souvenirs show up online. <laughs> you know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 Eager Beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey. That's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate. You're on camera. I'll take the wheels. Let's get a before photo. Soon as it'll be you and me. Out of the frying pan. All right, kids. Good to go. Just remember the rules, please! I got the bang stick. Yeah, I heard that about you. Ha ha. You ever have to use one? On a shark? Nope.
She been flesh is up tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command? No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Pass. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Weather looks clear. Mm. I'll have to keep an eye on those clouds. Uh-oh. It's getting mighty crowded out here. Hello again, little blip. What's she doing all the way out here? Hi. Hey. You okay? Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. What got you into World War II? Just stuff I read about in school. Then I found out my grandpa was in the Navy, got lots of medals. I wanted to understand what he'd been through. Got me hooked. I just hope they respect the site. People died there. They understand the rules. They get it. But I'm not sure how much that actually matters to Julia. Julia's got Alex wrapped around her little finger. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. keep these around.
Wow, that is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels... off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid. Okay? Here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really. On the rear turret. Huh. Good on ya, Connie. The turret. We can get in through there. first can I just take a second to say holy shit Alex we did it I mean can you believe it it's a dream come true <laughs> let's not waste any time not exploring oh. go 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 Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe is pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Don't be such a gonad. I'll be fine. 
gonad? Seriously? Am I dead? What's happening? Live a little, Edgelord. something stupid down here that's it one chance you get that chill out i'm fine see no problemo this says it was a rescue plane launched from a u.s base they were on their way to help out a ship Bullet holes, all down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. Brad told me that sometimes they would take a bomber and turn it into a search and rescue plane. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. Co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
What the hell happened here? From the look of things, they knew they were goners. We gotta get out of here, now! Shark, not interested in us. Let's go. Hold on. Uh, oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't I guess. Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia. Will you marry me? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh... Okay, come on guys, the gig is up! Julia, I'm serious. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes, yes, I'll marry the shit out of you! <laughs> All right, handsome hero. You want to get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there! Wait, we have to decompress! Damn it. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. Fuck it, I'm going. Hey, JJ, don't worry about it. Oh, nothing. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Conrad, what is wrong with you? So, why are you paying the ocean? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. Well, they got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys. Can you all just shut up for like one second? Holy shit! Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. <laughs> You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish, both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life, and he the love of hers. What about Conrad, a bold fellow, you might say? Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret.
So we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball. Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Oh, well, needless to say, this lady was impressed. <laughs> well played there, man, no? Wasn't Conrad gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mrs. Julia Smith? Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans, eventually. Now you're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. <laughs> I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. I was surprised, you know? I kind of wasn't sure how to respond. Julia, is there something we need to talk about? Oh my gosh, Alex. I was just shook up from the plane falling apart around us. That's all. No biggie. Okay. Cool. Cool. I'll go find Brad and everybody. Hey, you seen my brother or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. So, which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? What's your problem? Give it a rest already. Okay, that's enough of that. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. 